Oh, amazing, hello. I'm staying somewhere I've never been before. Literally, I'm in a golf buggy driving there. I can't believe it. Don't know where it is I'm staying, but let's go. Oh, this is the life. Loving bloody hangers. Oh, come down this way. <laughs> Wow. Oh, go slowly. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Oh. This is amazing. I love it round. Oh, amazing. Full disclosure, this is the next morning. Here is where we left the golf buggy that I drove yesterday. Wow, this place is amazing. It has to be the most amazing, quirkiest, small house. Just look at it. I know, its design is a cricket pavilion, but it looks like something out of the Wild West. It's themed so well. I can't believe we're staying here. The reason we're staying here is my 44th birthday whilst we're here. It was a surprise place to stay from my husband, but wow. Look at it, it's incredible. I just love the design of it. Look at the box hedge, it's perfect. And the pathway leading up to the small house. Ah, oh, it's ideal. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Isn't it amazing? Just look at that. We've got a porch here to sit on. Great place for a coffee, first thing in the morning. And just to sit and watch the world. A beautiful place to watch the world. Round here, we're coming up to a hot tub area, a beautiful hot tub. I love these casks and this seating area, painted pink. Loving the hooks on the walls, this is really handy for towels, for when you're in the hot tub. They've thought of everything. And I even love, these pennants are beautiful. I've never seen wooden pennants before painted, but they're just perfect. A nice watering can as a touch for the view. Oh, what a place. But this porch is something else. Look, there's a room on the top floor. Stay tuned because I'll be showing you what's up there. And that hot tub, by the way, is amazing. Come down here, come down this way, back past the seating area. I love all the detail here. In this pot. Look at these stones in this dish and the blanket on the chair. It's just cozy, very higgy vibe going on. And come into this area. This is the sun lounge area. Here's Ash, my husband, if you haven't met him before. Hello. Thank you, Ash. It's a great place. Thanks for bringing me here. You're welcome. Ash is reading. Look. Oh, oh I have to show you. That door leads you out. Let's go inside the pavilion. But it does feel like, I feel like I'm in the Wild West. Look at that vibe, even though it's a cricket pavilion idea, the feeling's amazing. Look, loving the bunting up here. Perfect. Anyway, let's head inside. This is the front door. Ooh, this is the name of the place. Porky Hooten's Pavilion. Got some hooks there. This place is so quirky. 
I love it. I love the cricket pavilion vibe. So, here we are. Oh, I'm gonna take my, um, I've got flip flops on. Take those off, because this flooring is incredible. It's amazing to walk on. Proper floorboards. This place is new, but it's been decked out like it's old school, and I love that. <laughs> Beautiful. I love a mat like that back at home. It's so beautifully done. That's something about this place. The fabrics, oh, you can hear the floorboards there. And everything's been so wonderfully appointed. Anyway, let's go into the main living area. You, you're gonna love this. Here's the kitchen. Everything you can need. We've got like a lovely fridge and freezer. The oven, but just, I love how it's all been painted and cur curated. Look, these cupboards are lovely. Oh, and everything on top of the cupboards. There's lovely planting going on. That's a spider plant there. Oh, I'm loving these lights. These lights are incredible. And, ah, oh, Amelie film poster in French. Love that quirky vibe going on. And the cricket pavilion vibe, loving the cricket bat. This is such, and then the PH for Porky Bootums. It's so well appointed. Look at this fireplace. <sighs> you can really like that. We don't need to at the moment, but I'm loving that stove. It's beautiful. And the tiles. The tiles are all very Moroccan-esque. Oh, it's beautiful. Absolutely insane. And then the seating area is wonderful. Oh, so that's the living area. Let's go through into the bathroom. That's through here. These doors, by the way, are incredible. They're floorboards themselves, I think, but it just is adds such a wonderful quirky touch. Anyway, here's into the bathroom. In here, I'm loving this mirror is awesome. And I'm loving the blue tiles everywhere. Ooh. You've got a shower, perfect shower. And these towels are wonderful. The blue towels and a towel rail. Ooh. They even have given us like dressing gown robes. Beautiful. Oh, such nice touches. What a place. I love this tiny house. Let's go into the bedroom. Oh, loving like these hangers and the hooks to hang your stuff on if you want to. We're here for a couple of nights, so we haven't. We just love how it looks. So you've got some cupboard space here to put stuff in to take stuff out of the suitcase. A corner cupboard, but ah, oh, loving the peacock thing going on the wall. But I just love the decor. This bed, look at this bed. The bed is amazing. It's so kitsch, very kitsch this place. The color on the walls just really works very well. It's been so well done. I'm loving the blue accents shelving. This place is amazing. Oh, oh there, hello. <laughs> Look, these shelves, incredible. Great for putting stuff on, but a just really nice touch for the room. Loving the lamps. The side tables are wonderful. Oh. So there you go, that's the bedroom. Oh, this view outside the front door. The pathway leading up. <laughs> you can hear the cockerel. Incredible. Let's take you upstairs. Like these stairs, you gotta be careful of them, but these are amazing. 
clip. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's the whole top floor. This is incredible, isn't it? Let, let's look back into the main living area. Oh, it's amazing looking down. But this whole top floor, <gasps> it's a whole secret like area. Oh, it's incredible. Another space, another level. And that's that window, where that window you saw was. It's here, another area just to lounge on. I love spaces just to be in. Beautifully done, what a small house this is. And there's even, I love this, Hooton's Vintage, a little honesty store. So you've got hats here, there's a bag. I'm loving, look at these. I don't think that's my size, but they're lovely, these pumps. But also, look, look at this teacup. Teapot even. <laughs> I love it. How wonderful. How wonderful. I've never stayed anywhere before. And there's a whole like vintage honesty shop going on. Oh, incredible. What a place. I'm loving this Spanish Armada teapot. Wow. So yeah, this is the honesty box. Love this. Such a wonderful lovely idea. It's so quirky. Oh, let's have a look out the window. So this is from that window you saw down there. That's a hot tub there and the seating area and looking out over the fields. The fields are amazing around here. Oh, that's a golf buggy I drove in. <laughs> Just look at it. <sighs> this place is mesmerising. Seriously. Oh, it's such an incredible space up here. Oh, oh, this is the life, isn't it? Just relaxing back here. I love this upstairs space. And you can see down into the living area. Those lights and everything. Oh, oh peacock feathers. I'm loving the peacock feathers going on here. And that Buddha. Oh, I love on top of the shelving, like how it's all been done. And it's so quirky and well appointed and just beautifully conceived and created. Absolutely love how it feels really old. And there's some antique bits here, but it's, I think it's been fairly newly done, but it just feels so quirky and old and lovely. It's a wonderful place to be and spend time. Oh, just look at it. Thank you for joining me at the quirkiest small house ever. Just going to enjoy some time now in the hot tub. If you like this video, why not check this one out? Thanks for subscribing and I'll see you in the next one. Time now for some hot tub time. What a beautiful tiny house.